Hello everyone, my name is Ammo and welcome to Do Not Disturb, a short indie horror game on itch. That is all I know about it. Uh, this is my developer, Kev e editor Kevin. Um, he also develop de developed me from a... Fuck, I'm starting that again. <laughs> Fucking hell. This is my editor Kevin, he's in the description below. Go and check him out, and also check out the game if you're interested. Otherwise, let's get into it. Get the cart from housekeeping. Oh, okay. Uh, what? Okay, sure. Um, I'm- also I'm housekeeping. Uh, da 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 no one here. No. Okay. Good. 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 Uh, room is clean. Leave it and close the door. Okay. Yep. Easy. 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 Room. Five hundred two. Housekeeping. No. Everything all right? Yeah. Not really. There's a sandwich that. Whoa. I just floated out of the bed. Um. Room to use trash bag to clean. Ah. Okay. Alrighty. Let's let's do this. Sandwiches. I'm gonna pretend I'm just tall, you know. Okay, it's all clean. Close the door. And back there. And moving on. Ah! Okay, that's open. Housekeeping! No one having sex in here? No, good, good, good. Alright, that. And then we'll take. Oh, I can just go over the bed, yeah. Don't think about that. I'm not the one that has to clean the beds. Stacy is. Fucking Stacy. Housekeeping! Oh, someone was definitely fucking in here. Yep. It's a cube. <laughs> Put it there, and then get that new sheets. Get rid of the, the stains. I'm going to ignore that. So it's not safe to be outside the, the window like that. If you don't leave when I come back around, I'm going to throw the trash out in your face. Freaking weirdo. Alrighty, let's go. Housekeeping. Someone turn the TV on. Too bad the remote is not here. Um, because that's loud and in my ears. Alrighty, let's fix this up, shall we? Must be the wind. Trash bag. Let's see, we got this. We got this. Are these coffee cups? Get out. Alright, calm down, calm down. If you don't want me housekeeping, then tell me earlier. Tell me earlier. Tell me early. Get the fuck. Motherfucker, how dare you? Is the game fucked? God damn. I'll play that again because that was. It started to get scary. <sighs> I wish I could run though. I didn't notice him there before. I'm just gonna close that. Um. Okay, so this game is very much randomly generated, which is cool, because I was expecting to stay quiet until I got to room 505 and that happening. So, I've got to... The dude's over there now? What the... Jesus. Oh, bathroom replaced towels. Ah, oh, something different. Alright, pretty much back where I left off. Uh, it's towels and trash. Towels. Someone put too much lube on that door and it just keeps opening. That's a problem, but uh, we, we deal with it. The fuck down. Okay, you're over there. Hello, sir. Again, if you don't want me in the room while you're doing your shit. Why did that not remove? What the hell? If you don't want me in the room while you're doing your shit, then put a do not disturb sign. It's all I request. Think he fell. Well, that's one less customer. Oh, fuck. Alright, 
You good? You didn't like the, the suicide joke? Wasn't really a suicide joke, I... But still, they didn't like the joke. Yeah, that, that first time the game... The fuck? Did I just trip over something? What the f <laughs> The first time I, I did these, I'm just gonna make sure the door's open at all times, just in case there is... That. Don't you dare close on me. Well, I may as well get the trash. Alright, let's try this again. It's because this stain doesn't mean you have to drive me out. We all know that what the stains are. It just makes it worse if you're trying to kick me out. Alrighty. They're all clean. To the next ones. Yeah, but it really isn't safe you being out there. Okay, looks like we got trash. Do your thing. Calm yourself down. It's fine. I know you are masturbating. Look, just jump out the window before I come around that corner, okay? You're gone? Yeah, you're gone? Okay, good. I mean, I know I get paid the big bucks for this, but jeez, some customers. Alright, what else needed to cleaning? The bathroom towels need to be replaced. Did I get too close to you? Did you fall? So are you okay? Oh, he's in the infinite void now. That's that room done. Lock. Jesus. Housekeeping. Let me try this again. Housekeeping. Come to clean up. Don't have to be testy. Alright. We good? Yeah. Don't slam that door on me. Good. There we go. What do you want? Replace towels. And there we go. Oh. <sighs> the owner always loves raves. All rooms are clean, take the car back to housekeeping. Hey bud! <laughs> Dispose of the full trash bag with the trash chute. Put the dirty laundry in the washing machine. Alright, shift complete. Get to the elevator and go home. Hell yes! Gonna go and cook some two minute noodles. Definitely an interesting game. Kind of annoying that the game crashed when I got killed the first time or hit the first time. I don't know if I was actually meant to die or what, but it crashed the game. Yeah, I mean, it was creepy throughout because of the little bits of paranormal activity. And definitely that first time it was like, get out. That was terrifying because like the door's closing and then the thing's coming towards me. And then I was like, holy crap, it's not, like the door's not opening for me. That was creepy, terrifying, whatever. That was good. The other times weren't as good, though it was definitely good that it was randomly generated. So I didn't expect to go into the first one. I expected to go into like the first two rooms and be like nothing there. But then like, yeah, there was so many other things. So yeah, that, that was interesting. It was definitely good that it's randomly generated because obviously when it crashed, like I had to redo everything, but it was something different. I guess if the the get out thing happens i feel like the entity should appear because i feel like it only ever appeared the first time that it happened which crashed the game but i'm assuming that's also if you're in there for too long then he spawns in and then he slowly comes towards you i would assume that's what happens but i feel like the entity should spawn in at like a specific point and then slowly come towards you or something like that because it makes it more creepy because like let's just say you're filling up the, the towels or something like that he's there in the opposite corner and it's just flashing get out and it's like holy thing fuck that thing's gonna come and get me so that would be that would be good but yeah 
Otherwise, decent, short, creepy game. So, yeah, hope you all enjoyed. If you did, hit the like button. If you're new, subscribe. If you're watching this on YouTube, go check me out on Twitch. If you're on Twitch, check uh, check me out on YouTube. Also, if you're on Twitch, stick around because I'm streaming more of these. And again, YouTube, I stream many of these horror games, a lot more than goes up onto YouTube. And yeah, go check out Kevin who's editing this and go check out the developer. And that is all I need to say. Have a great day and night. I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.